So marriage, it is God divine, but sometimes it is not even close to perfect. We love our spouses like we love no other, except for God, of course. But if we are honest at times, they can seem more hard than easy to bear in some ways. When two people with two different backgrounds, two different minds, two different opinions come together to be one flesh, just as the Bible says, there is bound to be some struggle sometimes. But God, he is a restorer. And as long as we are willing to not give up on each other, there is no marital or family issue that our God cannot fix. There is no flame of love that he cannot rekindle. There is no heartbreak that he cannot heal if it is surrendered to him. We will not be perfect in our marriage and neither will our spouse, but you know what? That's okay because we can never be perfect. Only Jesus is perfect and we are not called to be perfect. We are just called to love each other more than we love ourselves and to submit to one another, putting the other's needs before our own. And listen, if God is the head of the marriage, if he's truly the head, then that marriage, it will never fail. But if God is not truly the head, that leaves the door open for the enemy to come in and wreak havoc in your home. And not just between you and your spouse, but if you have children between t- children too. I realize the camera's over here and I keep looking away. Um, but if God is the head, we will never fail. Don't give the devil access. He hates a godly marriage and he seeks to destroy families, especially Christian families. God is our protection, though, and we must let him have first place.